Welcome to Planner Reporting in Power BI. Planner Reporting gives you a choice of various pages, various views, between tasks and groups, buckets, various planner things. You've got the the user Gantt, the decomposition. Notice there, there's there's a filter over here, and we'll show you how to use that in a second. But we'll just um, get into this, um, and and here we can expand tasks. Now you can also do things, and let's do it. Let's do it right here. Let's. Um, Let's create a bookmark and we'll create a personal bookmark and we'll call it um, Lydia Decomp. If I can spell it. And we'll save that. Now you know she's got some options there. You can make it the default. You can um, you can update it. So, but let's. Um, this is not a, a global filter, but we can actually do a filter across everything. So let, let's go to the person page, which is a interesting place, and we'll, and we'll take our our top team here, and um, and we'll just select them who else have we got um, Lydia of course and we'll create a bookmark for this and we'll call it my team and we'll make it the default view as well So now, every time we come in here, we will see this. But not only this, but these filters travel across all the pages. So now we are just seeing pa the task for three people. And here we can see the pop-ups for the tasks and what's going on. You really are, um, it's up to your imagination um, how you use this um, and he here is the hierarchy which is not linked um, oh sorry this list is linked but this is not a true filter so um, this filters what is available so um, we need to um, there is a filter page let's just clear our filters off There we go, all filters cleared. Um, and this gives you date filtering, so you, you can layer the two types of filters as well. Um, so you can start with a, a due this week filter. And we see we've got five tasks due this week. Um, and then go into the, the hierarchy. Um, that's that's perhaps not a good one to do let's go into the um the task hierarchy which um which has the five tasks that are due this week and um and we can use those um and we can see who the people are who are impacted and we can view well, there's not a lot of detail on those tasks but never mind um so that's about it this this is book bookmarks are the way to go um, and let's make a a this week report 
reporting on a number of groups. Um, there are two groups here, Planner 1, Planner 2. Um, let's just clear our filters for a second. Right, two groups, three plans, um, various buckets. It does attempt to um, normalize um, things like categories and buckets. It does help if they're all in tune with each other across plans. They don't have to be. Um, and you've got the buckets. Um, and that's about it. You know, you've. Um, in the app, there's actually a, a link to Planner itself. Um, this is all uh, refreshed on the schedule. You can refresh um, on on your own schedule. So there's a dashboard, which is not a lot on it. This is on the tummy data, which which you will see if you download this report. So. Um, that's planner reporting for Power BI. Thanks for listening. Get the latest news at the planner reporting website, which should have everything that you need to use this solution.